Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel where the Sandy travels and this is our completed solar shower. It's taken us a month to make because we're really lazy, but this is how to make a DIY solar shower on a budget. So this we use for our showers, we just bought everything from Bunnings. So yeah, enjoy the video. Everybody telling me a lie. Lord, they give me something for my soul. See, I don't want to think of suicide. So please don't take the lucky on my door. See, I've been tired of fucking all these girls. And I've been tired of spinning on my door. And if I get my story to the world, I wonder if they book me for a show. See, you can Okay, so we just finished. It's on the floor there. It's all been um, cemented together. You would have seen that in the time lapse. We used this from Bunnings and we had a bit of an accident and spilt it all on the grass, but that's okay. Um, so you can see that's what it'll be like, but we're spray painting it in the morning. Um, we will put all the links for what we bought from Bunnings in the video. Um, but yeah, so looks pretty good. What's up guys? So we got the back here. We just got, I think it was like a female 45 degree something from Bunnings. So we've got two screw on caps we're gonna do. On the bottom one, we're just gonna have a tap that comes down. And you can plug your hose in so you open up. Oh. Sorry, take two. <laughs> so we'll have a tap up here, plug your hose in down here. We're gonna have both these open, tap the shower. Um, and at the top, we're gonna have like a tire pump valve. I think it's called a schnauder, schnauder, schnauder valve or something. Air compressor it up. I'm pretty sure it can hold 20 ish litres of water, so that should get us a couple showers before we can refill. And yeah, like So said, we'll spray paint it black tomorrow morning. We'll, because we'll wait for the cement to all dry and stuff, but yeah. Woo. Okay. I just finished at Bunnings. It was very hectic. Um, I'll show you what we got. Don't mind that. Okay, so this is the tap we bought, which will be hooked onto like the end, which will have our hose plugged into it. Um, and the shower tap so we bought hopefully it fits if not we can just return it um and then we bought for mounting it on we got these so this one it'll be like a figure eight like this will hook on and this will attach to the roof racks so hopefully that stays on so we got six of the big ones and three of the little ones and then we got some seal tape I'm not sure what for, this is just what Ethan sent me. And then this thing, which Ethan found from um, another YouTuber who said that they are really helpful when going to like camping sites um, because they hook on to like everything. It's called the Anti Vandal Garden Tap Key. Value for money from Fix a Tap. So, can't recommend it yet because we haven't actually used it, but we'll let you know um, when we're on our trip, if it's worth it or not. So that was a good $100. Hey guys, so we're painting the water pipe now. We went to Bunnings and we got some Squirts Prime and Paint. They gave us the wrong one though, they gave us Gloss Black. So I found some, I think we got some like a so leftover, whatever this is, but that's matte black. So that's what we really want. So we want it to absorb the sun obviously, and Gloss is just gonna reflect it, so yeah. Baby call the doctor from my hill. You know it's kinda hard to say the drugs. Cause I've been having problems with myself. And I've been asking questions what it love. Alright, so we're finished now. It's a few hours later. We've done two coats of the paint and prime and then a final thick coat of the matte black. Um obviously black to try and absorb the heat. We want hot showers, so if you think about it, cold days, cold showers, hot days, hot showers, travel in summer, so hopefully more hot days than cold days. A little quarter turn tap here with just the normal, you know, plug and play tap adapter there. Just got some cement on the inside that will dry in a few minutes, hopefully, and then waterproof it all. We still need the air valve to come so that we can pressurize it all and we'll refill on this top butt here. 
and yeah for now we'll just test with waterproof and if it's all good we'll be mounting it up shortly hey guys so it's been a few days a few few weeks since we have four weeks since we did our water pipe but we have finally got what we needed we bought our Hey, we don't know how to say the word. We Kitchen. think schnauder valve we or something. We got our schnauder. German. German. Um, it was literally you eleven dollars from a bike shop. Ten bucks. So, oh my yeah. God, it was all we need, basically, if you're gonna do this, all you need is that. Just that little valve. It's just like if you have you a bike that you don't use, just take it off it. It's what you pump up every basically tire with. There's also like a pressed valve, but. It sounded a bit fancy, so we went with this one, but you have to buy the whole tube, so we're just gonna cut it down. We got, and here, the top cap, like I was saying in our video when we were making this, got the 45 female, I think it is. So, we just, yeah. Actually, we'll go to a montage, so if I fuck anything up, we can edit it out. <laughs> Later. TV color doctor for my health. You know it's kinda hard to say the drugs Cause I've been having problems with myself And I've been asking questions what the love And they don't give me answers just a check And they don't know my issues So, then I just got the um, high pressure PVC cement again Because it was the closest thing we had on hand I just got it drying in there I'm just trying to hold it to make sure that it doesn't lift anywhere And then air can get through We'll seal it on the other side too, just to make sure it's airtight. Because obviously we want to pressurise it. It's the whole point to like, you know, get the power out of the shower. So if there's any cracks or any leaks, it's not going to work properly. And when we're on the road, obviously that's going to suck. So we'll wait for this to dry. Then we'll fill it up. We'll give it a test. Get the air compressor or something on it. And yeah, sweet. We got it on. There's our travel house. That was our valve. Um, just filled it up with like... 10 ish liters. We'll just test the different fits. Like, yeah, we do have the air compressor. Am I fucked to use it? No. But am I fucked to use a bike pump? Ooh. <laughs> Maybe we should let it dry a little bit more. Why? <laughs> it's puffing out a little bit there. I can't see anything. Oh, there. it's all coming out. No, it's not all coming out. It's just, oh. <laughs> there is quite obviously pressure. Oh, we'll just leave it there and then just... Eee, there's our water! But is it that just coming out because it's Probably. at an angle? <laughs> I think it needs a lot more than that. <laughs> I'll restart. What's up? We got it on. So this is our solar shower. We got zip ties all the way along to the front. It's not going anywhere. We do have hose clamps and we've had a slight change of mind, but I'll quickly just run you through the whole setup just from start to finish. We've got our quarter turn tap up here, plug and play for the hose down the back for a fridge. Up top, we got the schnauder. <laughs> took us four weeks to get, but we got it. It's all working. Um, we originally put duct tape and some cement behind it, but mm. chemical reaction stuff, it didn't work. So we've got a F load of silicon all over it. It's waterproof, it's airtight. I think there's two small leaks, but I can fix them up on the go, they're all right. Um, two meters long, could be about 20 liters. Test fit it today, all works well. And yeah, it's pretty nudged on there. All right, now we've had the change of mind. So at the moment, as you can see, go there, a lovely lady. Um, it's on the outside of the roof rack. Our new plan is to put it on the inside here so it's a little bit more stable over corrugations and stuff. And also because Soph likes her privacy and wants to get a shower tent. So now the new plan is solar shower is going to go on the inside of the roof rack and the new shower tent is going to go here. Oh, that drop down. The whole kapow, 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 kapow. But yeah, this is our solar shower, and yeah, cheers for watching.